Breaking news coming in. The auger machine will now be used in pushing the uh, pipes. An official has uh, made the statement that the role of the auger machine will now no longer be drilling, but instead it will be used in pushing the pipes into the debris once the way is cleared by the men. He further said that because of the mixed approach being adopted, the time taken to reach the trapped workers may range from 15 to 18 hours, depending on how fast the debris is removed by the team. Akshit, my colleague, is joining us on the broadcast to give us more uh, latest updates on uh, what's uh, going on at Uttarakashi right now. Akshit, over to you. Uh, well, yes, uh, now the auger machine will be used uh, for pushing the pipes uh, and it will, uh, uh, you know, no longer be used for drilling because uh, it has constantly been, uh, you know, uh, 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 it has constantly been facing uh, uh, obstacles uh, because of the iron roads uh, between, uh, between, the, uh, uh, between the rubble uh, 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 and uh, between the debris. Uh, and uh, that is the reason uh, that uh, they are also exploring some other options as well uh, because uh, uh, a few hours uh, back, uh, a vertical drilling machine also reached uh, at the site uh, where the workers are trapped and the option of vertical drilling is also being explored. Uh, a high level emergency meeting uh, is also perhaps going to take place. If I just show you the visuals also right there, uh, then right there at the top you can see uh, some of the uh, officials uh, and uh, the workers of the agencies also visiting and from there only you know uh, the vertical drilling process uh, will start if, if it gets uh, approved and the total length uh, from atop the mountain uh, to uh, where uh, the workers are stranded currently is approximately 90 meters so of course it in itself is a very complex process because drilling uh, through 90 meters uh, from the top is not an easy task it, it's it's a very daunting and a complex uh, process uh, which will be carried out and uh, after uh, the auger machine yesterday met with a technical snag, uh, it, uh, it, the, the work uh, has been halted. And there uh, you can, uh, of course, uh, see uh, the movements also perhaps uh, of the officials of different departments uh, and uh, be it the NDRF, SDRF, uh, ITBP uh, and uh, uh, the, the state departments also uh, putting out all the stops uh, to uh, rescue the 41 workers who are stranded inside the tunnel uh, for almost 14 days now. Uh, and uh, of course, uh, many officials are visiting here uh, to chalk out a roadmap, uh, to chalk out a strategy as to how to get uh, those workers out uh, uh, of the tunnel uh, safely. Uh, and uh, when we talk to the officials also, uh, uh, the, the essential items are being provided to them, be it food, water and the oxygen supply. Uh, and uh, there is a large area also uh, where uh, uh, they can sit also inside the tunnel. But still, uh, the, the uh, uncertainty is looming uh, around everyone's head as to when uh, these worker, uh, workers uh, will get uh, out of the tunnel. Akshit, uh, there is also some confusion about uh, how much more time is needed to get these workers out. Uh, there's also, uh, you know, some criticism coming in about the mixed approach, which has led to certain delays. What can you tell us about that? Well, uh, the officials here are saying that we cannot tell the estimated time to take these workers out because the process, uh, it looks easy, but it's not an easy one. It's a very complex uh, and a daunting process because, uh, you know, when we look at the Himalayans, uh, then Himalayans are still very young and they are growing uh, because of the collision between Indian tectonic plates and the Eurasian tectonic plates. Uh, and, uh, of course, uh, the, the, the soil is also very loose uh, and, uh, you know, uh, uh, the, the, there is water seepage also due to which... Uh, when uh, they try to remove the debris around uh, uh, the workers, then uh, more debris uh, starts falling. Uh, and uh, there also you can see, uh, you know, a lot of concrete material has been put. Uh, so, of course, uh, when they, you know, construct a tunnel, uh, they, the, the method of four poling and short creating is uh, uh, generally used uh, so that uh, they can construct a stable tunnel. And, of course, rocks also the most uh, significant impediment uh, in the rescue operation has been uh, the percent persistent uh, you know encounter with hard and uh, underlying rock conditions over years of course uh, the officials are not giving any kind of estimated uh, time as to when will the workers get out but uh, they are saying that uh, uh, they are making all the efforts as cm dhami also uh, has directed them uh, to uh, fasten the uh, speed uh, of the ho uh, whole procedure to get this uh, workers out akshit also talk about the families uh, you know what arrangements have been made by the state at this point in time, because I'm sure some of these families would want to stay close 
uh, to where all of this action is taking place. Well, yes, uh, you know, a few minutes back only we talked to one of the family members of the trapped workers and uh, they are from Bihar and they are saying that uh, the workers, of course, uh, the trapped workers are being provided with uh, all the facilities and uh, the, the family members are also, you know, staying very closer to uh, this tunnel only. Uh, the arrangements have been made, but still they are saying that they appeal to the government that uh, the, that uh, the workers should get out very soon uh, because um, uh, uh, many experts have also suggested that uh, the temperature of uh, inside the tunnel uh, is way uh, different uh, uh, than what's, uh, what it is outside. So, of course, uh, that point also has to be kept in mind. And when they get out, uh, then, then 41 ambulances uh, have been uh, stationed uh, here uh, at the site. Uh, and uh, the workers will also be uh, kept under medical observation for 24 to 48 hours uh, till the time they go back uh, to their family members. So, of course, everyone is waiting for that breakthrough as to when these uh, workers will get out. Akshit, appreciate you joining us. Well, it's an important day for polling in Rajasthan as people are heading out to cast their votes. The elections are being contested by 1,862 candidates and the total number of voters is 5.25 crores. And uh, of course, a number of people will be, uh, in fact, are talking about and voting uh, what the issues in Rajasthan are. But of course, we're going to go back to Uttarakashi and uh, Take you through this report, which has just come in. It's the race against time, as it's almost two weeks now since the workers uh, who, are work who are working in the Silkiara uh, Dandalgao Tunnel uh, got trapped after the ten uh, after a portion of tunnel got collapsed uh, here in Uttra Ut Uttarkashi district of Uttarakhand, uh, and all the authorities, NDRF, SDRF, are battling to get the workers uh, out safely from uh, that that portion well right behind me you can actually see uh, the the uh, opening mouth of the tunnel uh, from where uh, the workers entered uh, uh, and were continuously working uh, and when the tunnel collapsed on november uh, 12 then only uh, their misery misery began and of course uh, all the authorities have put out all the stops uh, to bring back uh, workers safely and if i just tell you uh, the latest updates uh, then the uh, drilling by an um, american auger uh, machine uh, was halted uh, yesterday after it hit hit uh, one another uh, technical snag and now uh, there is no current uh, currently no timeline as to when the workers workers will be rescued uh, and uttarakhand chief minister pushkar singh dhami also directed all, all the agencies uh, to conduct the last phase of the rescue operations at a fast pace and the rescuers have decided to put a pipe uh, inside uh, inside the uh, drilled portion of the rubble because uh, the, the total portion uh, uh, of the rubble uh, fr where the workers are stranded right now uh, is about uh, uh, 50, uh, 55 meters and till now they have drilled 46 meters into it and almost 9 to 10 meters uh, is still left. Uh, so of course uh, that that is to be done uh, but uh, the, um, the the american auger machine uh, hit one another technical snag uh, because uh uh, there, if you just see, uh, right behind me is the tunnel, and uh, if we, if we, uh, and uh, 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 from the mouth of the of the tunnel, uh, to 200 meters away, uh, the workers are stranded. Uh, the uh, the, uh, the the rubble uh, just fell, the debris just fell, uh, and uh, it's it's almost 55 meters, and then the workers are stranded, and from the Silkiara side. Uh, it was al almost completed uh, 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 at uh, uh, f uh, the work was completed for about 2.34 uh, kilometers and from the Dandalgao side it was completed about uh, 1.75 kilometers and the total length of the tunnel is 4.5 kilometers so of course uh, 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 when the drill hits the metal object uh, then the, it has to uh, it has to be pulled back uh, uh, once again and then a person has to be sent uh, in the pipes uh, the 800 mm uh, mild steel pipes which are being inserted which are being pushed through uh, so that the workers can crawl through later uh, when all the pipes uh, uh, are, are put in and if, if I just also tell you uh, these pipes also you know it's uh, just to give you uh, in a little bit perspective these pipes are also not very broad in length uh, because 
बिकॉज इफ इफ यू लुक एट ह्यूमन देन ऑफकोर्स ह्यूमन्स ह्यूमन्स बॉडी इज ऑल्सो टू फीट ब्रॉड एंड दीज पाइप्स आर ऑल्सो ऑफ एट हंड्रेड एम एम सो ऑफकोर्स दे आर नॉट ऑल्सो थ्री फीट सो वेन द वर्कर्स वेन वेन अ पर्सन गेट्स इन टू इट ही हैज टू कैरी द कटर ऑल्सो द मटीरियल फॉर वेल्डिंग बिकॉज वेन वेन आयरन रॉड कम्स दे हैव टू कट इट सो दैट द ओगर कैन वर्क अगेन एंड ही हैज टू कैरी दैट ऑक्सीजन मटीरियल ऑल्सो सो ऑफकोर्स इट्स ऑल्सो नॉट वेरी ईजी to uh, go in there and work there so of course uh, that's why also it's taking a lot of time uh, to uh, bring back uh, the workers because now it's uh, it's been almost two weeks and the temperature also uh, inside uh, is you know very different from outside because outside it's very cold uh, and inside uh, as it's underground tunnel it's 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 a bit hotter uh, than outside so of course that is also being kept in mind and for that very reason only if, if we just pan around our camera Uh, then uh, of course you can see uh, a, a lot of machines are, are there a state of the art machines are the, uh, are here uh, so that uh, workers uh, can be you know brought back safely and the officials of ndrf sdrf and all the other agencies uh, are are present over here to carry uh, the uh, to carry out the operation uh, in full swing of course uh, the chief minister also is is taking uh, the stock of the situation the prime minister modi also uh, is taking the stock of the situation uh, and uh, they are hoping uh that uh, uh, uh the, to start uh, the drilling process uh, once again uh, very soon uh, because now only two pipes are left to be pushed uh, um, uh, and uh, the, the, the pipes are of 6 meters in length so of course uh, uh, when when the two pipes are pushed uh, they will reach the workers and then the workers uh, can be brought back uh, on stretchers because uh, yesterday also uh, the agencies released a video as uh, showing uh, showing a mock drill as to how the workers uh, will be brought back but as we say here of course uh, it's the race against time and it it will be important to see as to uh, when uh, will the workers uh, be brought back safely in uh, in uttarakashi with camera person akash akshit gupta for news x well after the uh, american auger machine yesterday night faced a technical snag different options are being explored here in uttarakashi uh, to bring back uh, the workers safely out of the tunnel uh, who who actually got trapped in the tunnel uh, on 12th november it it's now almost 14 days since they have been trapped inside and uh, right behind me you can see some exclusive visuals uh, on news x uh, the, the Uh, of course uh, the exploration um, being done on the plan b and this is the vertical machine uh, which will uh, of course uh, 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 you know put a hole uh, in the tunnel vertically from uh, upside uh, so that another way another uh, passage can be created uh, to bring back the workers uh, well Uh, as, as per the experts uh, there are uh, there are uh, almost five options and of course uh, they all are very complex and if we just uh, if we just tell you uh, that the team of experts also who were called uh, to the tunnel site to conduct a survey uh, have said that there is no obstacle up to the next uh, up to the next 5 uh, uh, meters uh, well uh, they uh, um, Uh, uh they actually uh, you know uh, got to know uh, that uh, uh, through ground penetrating uh, 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 monitor uh, well uh, uh, a technology and a meeting is also you know expected to take place uh, at the at the uh, site soon in which a decision on this uh, vertical drilling uh, will be made and the government agencies involved in the rescue operation have begun preparing for the vertical drilling and the machine uh, to be used uh, for the drilling has been uh, you know you can see actually has been uh, fully uh, installed and is ready to be mounted uh, upside tunnel and uh, if it's uh, successful then of course it can uh, bring back the workers uh, safely uh, uh, who who are actually trapped uh, inside the tunnel for almost 14 days now of course there are other options also uh, horizontally also uh, they they have uh, talked about you know uh, uh, preparing a passage uh, and uh, from the barkot side also the dendalgao side also uh, the, uh, the options are being explored and from the silkara side as we know the ogre machine Uh, you know is facing technical snags uh, continuously so the option of manual drilling is also being explored so agencies have put out all the stops uh, to bring back the workers safely and it remains to be seen as to how soon uh, they will be brought back uh, out of the tunnel in uh, uttarakashi with camera person akash akshit gupta for newsx for more such videos subscribe to the newsx youtube channel hit the bell icon